So uh, Nick and I only came up with another invention as well called the ghost sling. And uh, this is what it looks like. Basically a scabbard. And so what it is is uh, you have molly on the front and the rear. And the purpose of the ghost sling is to do more or less. And so what we did was we wanted to make a system so that you can attach stuff to it, like your first aid kit, uh, an extra magazine and so forth, uh, things of that nature. And the reason we did that, Nick and I have been teaching for, uh, I don't know, close to 20 years active shooter. And uh, what we found was everything would get tied up. The go bag, the rifle, uh, breaching backpacks, uh, all sorts of stuff, radios, and uh, nobody could get anything off. So we went back to the drawing board and that's how we came up with this uh, ghost sling. And basically it would go like such, the tool would ride your hip back here. You could have extra things mounted and then you could just go ahead and cinch it tight with the drawstrings. One quick release, pull that red tab and the tool slides out. So the premise is I pull up to the emergency I grab my ghost sling, which has all the stuff that my go bag would have already mounted on it. It has my tool mounted into it, my claw. I throw it on my back, like such. I cinch it down, grab my rifle, and go off to the emergency. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna set this in and show you how it works. So I have my 30 inch claw, like such. All right, so first thing you have to do is you have to insert that. So you just put the handle in. And when the handle comes in, there's a loop down here where the extra heavy duty bungee goes in. We're gonna put that so that it goes right here. Right square across the back. So what I like to do is I like to go ahead and I like to take the handle like such. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold it like this underneath. When I hold it like this, I'm gonna pull backwards and then we're gonna go forward. So you can either go here like this or put your thumb in there and then we're gonna pull down and we're gonna go around. And it just clips in there pretty easy. It's gonna take a little bit of energy, but for our customers, the end user requested the heavier bungee. A uh, couple reasons, uh, the other one uh, wasn't holding as much the way uh, when you were moving, and the other ones were, uh, uh, when they were being dropped on the ground, they were getting cut and so forth. So the reason why we even started uh, the business was customer feedback. So we always listen to what you guys have to say. So if you have feedback, let us know. So now you can see we're all mounted. We grab our tool. We throw it on our back, all right, we cinch it down, we're good to go, it's right in our hip. Now if I need it in an emergency, all right, without having to take all that stuff off, I go ahead and I just pull the tool up to the front, reverse the motion, I'm still supporting it. All right, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna pull this off, just like that. Now I'm gonna grab the tool here, and all I'm gonna do is just hold here. So I'm just gonna basically hold this loosely on the handle, and this is just gonna slide right up. There you go. Go sling. Breach her up.